Three survivors. Oh, I like the shadow of the tree on, on my, my thing. Well, that thing is horrendous. That is just, ugh. In so many ways. I really have to make something better than that. But uh, that's not for now. Um, I have two problems, actually. Uh, one of them... One of them is access upstairs. I mean, okay, this works, I suppose. But I don't want this. I, yeah, I don't want these things here. I want stairs. Playing stairs going up. But this is going to be a battlement. So and that kind of puts a, a, makes it uh, tough to have uh, stairs here. Well, now that I can th I think about it, uh, this is too, yeah, maybe I can make a garage door. Okay. All right, that's not going to be uh, expensive. I mean, I have only 1700 of iron on me, but I have a lot of iron. So I believe this is three by two, so three wide. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna, whatever. No. So I, I want to make like, um, I want to have some path going all the way not as much as some path but a roof I want a, a roof going all the way here um, yeah that works 27 no uh, trade the it response tomorrow so I want ground all around here. Um, as I mentioned before, the bottommost uh, pillar here is going to be turned into concrete. Um, so this will be like four high concrete blocks and that will align perfectly with the, uh, the wood bars. Uh, yeah, with the, not the wood bar, with this floor here. So turn this into a concrete block and everything here becomes floor. And maybe what I can do is I can have a stair going up from here. And then two more. Well, then again, there is the battlement thing. The battlement does need... Oh, then again, this, uh, this is a wall here. This is not a problem. It's going to decrease slightly the structure integrity, but that's not a big deal. Um... Oh, shit. Oh, whatever. This time I'm going to just go up right here. <laughs> So, I kind of want the floor to come from here. If I do this here, then that block there is the last piece of the stair. So and it starts right off the. Maybe I can. I should start from here. Let's ah. 
don't believe I did this again. <laughs> Let's look here inside. <coughs> so the stairs will be here if I start at that point, or here if I start a one block before. I mean that's that would be the last stair piece, and then this will be flat. And the battlement, I mean, this block does not exist. This is, um, this shouldn't be here. <laughs> so this is a battlement, one block outside. So this might be, for example, uh, um, a murder hole, a magicolation. Yeah, magicolation. Murder hole is on the ground, uh, on the floor. Like this is a murder hole. This is magicolation. Anyway, it will end here, which. I don't think it's bad. That might be workable. Yeah. I think that is actually workable. So these blocks here. And here. These two will be stairs. Okay. Stairs is the one block I haven't favored. Well, let me drop the springs and mechanical parts. I actually have to arrange that light there as well. I should have done that already. So we have the stairs ending here. This guy is doing almost 300 hit points per hit. I wish he did 300 hit points. That would be very nice. Yeah. We need to break this one as well. I will have to have some sort of rating here. This one's still uh, um, two, then I need two more. Okay. So you do get hit on these blocks. One block I can I think I think the arch would work pretty well here. I usually use ramps, which I think look better. Um than arches, but arches are more in For stone, arches are the right block. The one that provides structural integrity. Uh, 
or you could have wedge a wedge tip and then a wedge here it makes a nice opening but i think this might be good enough or you know just leave it open Oh no, it's doing almost 250 points. I thought it was doing almost 500. Hmm. Yeah, I think just leave that open. Uh, of course, I'll need uh, some railings, and railings needs to be made on the um, table saw. Uh, there are some options I can use uh, out of metal. It's just that I think metal will look out of place here. Okay, this might work. Where is it? Uh, three more, two more. There. Okay, so I can move uh, nicely here. Even when I put some stuff there. Uh, it's gonna prevent... Ah, oh, damn it. It's gonna prevent plates on this side. <sighs> so annoying that I can't seem to use these plates. I think I'm gonna ha I'll have to give up on them because this is another place where I'm about to break the plates to move these things outside. It's so annoyed by that. Yeah, so if I have these stairs here, let me arrange this guy. Alright, so if I have um, Why is it goes for the behind so much? Yeah, this is the wrong orientation, right? <laughs> uh, it really needs to open outside. That was stupid on my part. I should have thought of this. At least I did not upgrade it. Decent amount of hit points, to be honest. So, get springs, get mechanical parts. Uh, make another one. So, then we have the first obstacle, which is the drawbridge, and then they get here, and then they have to open a second door before they can come here and go upstairs. Um, yeah. I could make, make this a single stairs instead of double stairs, and then I could have a, a third door, a murder holes here to get the zombies, but I'm gonna leave that. Gonna make this only only <laughs> that the second part. 
I will have to make sure that I can hit zombies that are hitting this. Uh... <laughs> Hit in the gate, which means I have I need match collations here. I'll have to align the um, the battlements in a way that guarantees I have um, line of sight to the zombies. And that's actually on top of the door but on the other hand if i have the stairs i don't need that thing there i can remove it yeah <laughs> Oh, I thought that was okay. I thought it was supported by the ladder, but no, of course not. Ladder is one below that. <laughs> right. So I can have much collations here. Oh, even a single much collation right here on these as uh, arches. So an arch here, an arch here will give me an angle everywhere. And plus I can throw um, Molotovs right here. And the Molotov here is going to hit everyone that is on, on, against that. Um. <laughs> against that garage door. Uh, the garage door is the best thing I have for a medieval doorway. Yeah. So if I have it like this, then it opens out. Yeah. There. And now this thing is <laughs> really strong, really strong. Yeah, once I break this, then yeah, I'll, I'll... No bets are off. All right. Now I do have the, uh, the drawbridge. So I heard that they changed the drawbridge. Yeah. So annoying. They trained the drawbridge so you don't have uh, advanced, yeah, you don't have advanced rotations anymore. So you cannot use it to, for floating bases. That's fine. Let's hmm. break some windows there. And then. What was it? Um, it's three high, right? One, two, three, yes. So, 50s. Um, oh, it's favorite. Six of that. And then four arches. Right. Four normal flagstone blocks. And then. Do I go f with the incline this time? Or do I make it wedge like this? The incline is going to be thick, uh, f thinner. This looks like a huge stab of stone, slab of stone, you know? Um, so if I go with incline, I can perhaps start Yeah, I can start with uh, normal wedges Should I have another wedge? No 
can start with normal wedges, four of them. And then tip, incline, tip, tip, incline, tip, tip, incline. So again, tip, actually it's tip, tip. So tip, tip, one, yeah, tip, tip, this is wedge. Tip, tip, incline, tip, tip, incline, tip, tip, incline. So three of each. So for inclines, um, I had that block favorite. I must have unfavorite because I was not using it. So three times four, it's 12. And um, for the wedge tips, it's 12, but because I need uh, up and down, each one is 24. Okay. Now, the poles are one off the end of the drawbridge. <laughs> yeah. So this is the end of the drawbridge. This is going to be a, an, in, um, an arch. And we have these blocks here, and then one, two, three. And then the flex one block. So this is uh, like before, and we do have the wedges, and this guy has to go away. All right, uh, no, these are these are ramps. It so pisses me off that this is uh, there. It needs to be one more out. If it was one more out, uh, the hatch wouldn't be here. See, the hatch is here. The hatch would be here, which will give pretty good access to anything here. But we are not the fortunate ones. We make mistakes. And then the inclines. This is just so this has a uh, structural integrity um, until I finish the build. I have to copy rotation. Oh, I need four more ramps, and I need this thing to go away. These are blocks inside and outside. Interesting. 
Or maybe it's painted and the block is still there. Let's see. No. There are plates inside and outside. That's... Uh, that's curious. Okay. This one as well. Yeah, 250 then, it will be four hits. There. So this is what it looks like with inclines. Uh, it's, uh, it's thinner. <laughs> yeah, I think this looks better. Not gonna break that one, but I think this looks better. And of course, um, yeah, I, I was going to keep the gate here because it is off center. Well, I wonder something. One, two, three, four, five, six. Interesting. Six. double the uh, garage door size. Right. <coughs> this is my vending machine here. There's some nice you could use smoothie. Uh, you could use smoothie only protects against cold, does not protect against uh, heat. Someone was suggesting that to, to cage for protection against heat. I don't understand that. Or maybe cage misunderstood it. And though Snowberry Juice um, was supposed to protect you against cold, but it doesn't have anything here, so maybe it's a buff. I'm gonna buy one just to try it out. Or maybe buy one of these as well. Alright. Okay. And uh, now that we have the gate here, we can make this thing here. Uh, we need the corners. I don't know if I still have corners. Three, four, five, and then six. Up on the other side. <laughs> Two, three, four, five. Yeah, somewhere along the way, I miscounted. I think I missed two only. I think wrong. There's at least one more. <laughs> Yeah. So now we have the corbels, which uh, I'm using arches for the corbels. <sighs> One thing that I could use that will look a bit more like a corbel. I really want a quarter blocks for that, but I cannot make them um, with the right orientation, uh, just concrete parts. But maybe, yeah, the thing is that the arches are proper structures for this. Let's try one alternative design here. So let's use plates like here and here. Right. And then here, uh, copy rotation here. Mm. 
<laughs> yeah, that looks more like a corbel. Well, that's providing the ground. So these are half blocks, two half blocks on the outside, two. Ramps, where are the half blocks? Here. So let's copy from here. Yeah, two, two, and then alternate here. Now I have to go up there. Yeah. So the idea here then is... Oh, actually that one is correct, fortunately. Just did not like put the ramp instead. Damn it. I needed the ramp for something. Why is why do I have an extra ramp? <laughs> the wedge tips that should be here. Well. Let's try the on face thing. Yeah, I point at this block, but in a way that it's going to place it here and then I get the right rotation. Well, the blocks on the center like this, on the corner like this. And then I'm not sure if I have the No, I used all the rounded corners I had. <laughs> so I'll have a I'll have a rounded <laughs> corner here. And another one there. So those would be rounded <laughs> corners. So that's using corp, uh, arches as corbel. I think the arches are not corbel. Yeah, this is the Bailey I know. Yeah, that does look like corbels. But I don't think it looks good. Yeah. Quarter blocks might work. They go all the way down. But if I have used quarter blocks, then this is going to be really thick. That's why, uh, yeah. First world problems, I suppose. So let's get the arches. Here, let me take this away before it falls on the top of my head. Uh, 
Horn is going to be problematic. Actually, that's not where it goes. It goes uh, one, f one half <laughs> from there. Yeah, it goes like this. And then... I don't think I counted the corners. So this block here will be a wedge tip. Let's try the old face thing. No. This one doesn't work. Oh, I had it. There. Now, when I replace this, I have to remember not to... So good there. Better. There. And let's remove this and um, make six ladders. One, two, three, then I can go up the side. One, two, three, can go up the side. So can the zombies, but who cares? Something like this here, yeah. Oh, this is wood. Okay. Come on, hit the thing. Right. So let's get this back, and I actually need two more tips. Um, I think I need two more half blocks as well for the corners. Though not this one, okay, so I don't need two more, but yeah. Yeah, so it's like this and then this I can try the on face trick then copy rotation okay <coughs> that's nice I mean, one problem is that uh, if you start fighting, if they invade and you're fighting zombies, well, enemies here, you're going to get shot by the ones here. Maybe it should be inverted like uh, full and this side and then uh, the matriculation here and here for fighting zombies inside. Um, like this here so that you 
have your back protected uh, when fighting inside and fight, have your back protected when fighting outside. But uh, let's be realistic. It's not going to be that much of an issue. I mean, suppose cops get in here and they're zombies coming and you're trying to fight zombies here and then comes a cop and spits. Yeah, that would be inconvenient. So, now on this side, again, it's not going to work. The on face trick. There. And there. I'm going to place a second block here. So I can remove the ones down and place the, the curved things without uh, causing issues. Um, now, what did I do on that corner? I use a tip. <coughs> Sorry. So the tip is below. The tip is connected to this block. <coughs> so if I do on face here, this is the tip. And then go to the same level, yeah. Maybe that's my problem, the fact that it goes on the same level. Now, here on the other hand, yeah, I wonder if I can like break this block here and just make place a stair say <clears throat> so place a stair here so you can come and fight the zombies on this side and then I can Break this and this. The turret sign. I think I can pick up the signs, not sure. So here. I think perhaps the best will be to place arrow slits. Yeah, two arrow slits. <laughs> With this rotation. But how you would get protected? Maybe not use the curved thing there. Just truly have the... Half blocks. So if I make an arch on the other direction, 
Let's make two. Let's place some wood frames behind it. Yeah, I think I can also place an arch here. And maybe go with... Well, this is one where I don't want to center it, huh? You know what? I think uh, two half blocks. No. Ah. The thing is, I would need to do this on that side. Place an arch here. <coughs> and place an arch here. Feels like it should be one here, right? Okay, let's look at this thing <coughs> from both sides. So either a place at the corner or a place together, like we have two here and then two here and then the space, but this is at the corner. So Feels like at the corner would be best. Except. <coughs> Except I kind of need something here. I'm not sure I can go there if I put this place, this guy here. And the alternative is then break this and just make it flat. I don't need to protect people who are coming from here.
make another arch right there. Make another arch right there. Yeah, I mean, this gives the opportunity to shoot through there, but I think it's just, I think if you're coming to the tower, you, you'd rather be protected. I think it has to be full blocks here. <laughs> now, how do you protect yourself on this side? I think in this case, we are going to go with the plate. One, two, three. So we can double and then place another one here. No, we don't have the space here. I mean, with that, we do have the angle. Let's just look a little bit, a little more protected. And then here on the corner, I truly could just place full blocks here on the outside. Keep it round on the inside, but place full blocks on the outside. So it's going to be uh, three. Like this. You know what? This guy can go away as well. And even this guy here, I mean, the battlement is here. This guy is on the wrong position. It should be one more out. Then that would work out well. Uh, it would be here, right where this guy is. Yeah, I think this guy can go out. And we can just make this... Um, I have some yucca juice, I do. Let's get the iron back. Now oh, this guy would go away as well, but I'm not concerned at the moment. Yeah, this can go out. All right, guys, uh, we're getting to the end of this episode. Uh, it's day 27. Tomorrow is day 28. It's Horde Night. I'm not going to do any looting. Uh, this episode is going to be followed by another 
um, by another might be able to recover some armor from these guys. Yeah. Okay. Pretty decent. This really should be, I mean, it's fine for the stairs, but this should be at this level. I just don't think it's going to look good, sadly. But I can place um, <laughs> how many blocks? Let's break this guy here. This is one, the one on the stairs is two. Well, I have to count this with wood frames, otherwise I won't get the count correct. So looking at the arrow slits, I would say three. One, two, three blocks, yes. So if we are three blocks, then perhaps I can get two of these and then I'm uh, gonna use one tip. Um, two. Make it make it at least four just in case basically <laughs> so then I'll have an arch like this here place another arch here Actually, this box has to go away. Yeah. Okay, because this, my friends, is just going to be a quarter block because the battlement continues in this direction. The battlements continue in that direction, which means these two blocks also have to be something different. So I'm gonna place a couple of a couple of these. Put half block there. Just copy the arrow states because I have gonna have arrow states all the way there. Well, not all the way, except when I have arches and much collections. No. Yeah, I do have one. Got two as a matter of fact. Oh, face maybe. Yeah. Because then the battlement continues in this direction like this. 
And here, yes, we have a mortar hole. And on this side, I also want a full block. Yeah, like be better protected. It's a little bit of a mortar hole here. I'm gonna have another one here. Right. It's doing pretty good. More than 150 on iron, that's good. What the hell is supporting this ladder? Okay, that is ugly as hell. But at the very least, I can prettify it a little bit here. Have a little bit of a Batman motif, I suppose. But I think it works out. And you have to remember, this is going to be battlement all the way. So... Yeah. Now on this side is going to be slightly different. I'm going to make something similar but slightly different because I'm going to make the turret in the proper position here. So the turret will be like two out uh, like this. So this is the floor and then one block, two blocks out for the center. Uh, that's how that turret is going to be. Whereas that turret there is just one block out. And yeah, it changes uh, some things. I, I think it's going to work even better uh, on that other side with the turret further out. Now let's just go outside and see what else <coughs> we need to do here. Yeah, it really could use another um, arch. Right there. It's not very visible, but it's there. There's something here in the VR slits. So yeah, let's make the archer all the way through. through here. <coughs> I have nice angle here on everyone. Yeah. <coughs> I think this is uh this has worked out uh, pretty well. I think this worked out pretty well. So let me break this guy here. Uh, 
No, it doesn't give me much iron. Let's see if I get something when I destroy it. 13? That's crap. Okay. No, it might be floating because, it's, yes, it's connected here. So I need to break the ladder and this block. There. <laughs> Rope ladders, yeah. Rope ladders would be pretty good. So this is the bailey, and still a few blocks missing there. I'll have to go to a cement mixer to get that uh, finished. But the gatehouses are, well, not really gatehouses. Going for the other one. There. Good, good. Oh, I have this. Okay, I forgot. All right, guys. Um, so that's going to be all for today. I really intended to do more than um, what I what I have done. Oops. I really intended to do more, but I think all in all, this was pretty successful. Oh, and I have to do the farm. So um, that's going to be all for today. I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching.